What's up, guys? So I remember back when they first signed Gable Stevens and how big of a star they thought he was going to be. And he really hasn't done anything in the WWE since they signed him. And today he was released from his contract. And I didn't know that he was going through the, the court shit. And if he did what he's being accused of, good fucking riddance. But if he didn't, he wasn't really approving in his wrestling, so he was going to get released anyway. But what Dave Meltzer says here, if this is true, it's kind of bullshit what the WWE did to him. So, the timing of the cut is especially cruel because had it been a few weeks earlier... He could have competed in the Olympic trials, which, based on his 2023 performance, he'd been he he'd have been the heavy favorite. He would have been a favorite for either gold or silver medal in the Olympics this summer, had he done so. But it's too late to make the U.S. team, as Mason Paris will be the heavyweight. So if that is true, that's total bullshit. If they they knew they were going to release him, they should have released him a couple weeks ago. And now they're releasing him. After he, now he doesn't have a chance to compete in the Olympics. I still don't give a shit about him if he did what he's being accused of. But until that's proven, we can't really call him that. So he lost out. With his contract from the WWE. But he also lost out of the Olympic. Uh, Olympic trials. To go into the Olympics. So this dude lost. Lost. And it might be karma really kicking his ass. Because if he did what he did. Karma's really fucking giving him an ass kicking right now. Like, comment, and share guys. If you want to support my channel. You can do so through my cash app. Or my shop where I just posted some sports cards. So go check it out. Or a super thanks. We'll see you guys out in the next wrestling news video. Peace.